Untold story from Kora Obidi. Guys, this story will make you shed some tears. Yes, my people. I couldn't hold back my tears when I was watching this video. Guys, this video is very touching. Yes. And may God continue to bless this woman. Guys, watch this video, then we'll come back. Wow, she gave birth on live video. Wow, oh my gosh. You know? Congratulations were pouring in from all over the world. My ex-husband became crazy, started to talk. I don't know if it was postpartum, I don't know what it was. Anyway, I was kicked out of the house at about a week postpartum. I was told to go get a new house, get out of the house, you know. I was like... <sighs> Next thing you know, I was going to look for the houses and he said, oh, I can watch the kids while you go look for houses. I was like, thank you. So I gave him the kids and I went to look for the houses. When I found a house, I came back home. Boom. My kids were nowhere in the house. I called him. Where are where you guys? Where did you guys go? He said, I've taken the kids, Cora. <laughs> At that point, I was like, what? Okay. So my, I literally, postpartum, I, I literally slumped to the ground and I just went into a ball and I just was shaking like this and shaking and shaking. LA mom, let's just say that my father and, it's not a relationship that just came out of nowhere. It's from my family and she just stepped in as a representative she was she just called me hey hello i was like oh, i can't find my kids i don't know where my kids are i don't know where my kids are calm down calm down it's time for you to get a lawyer you're not dealing with a normal person it's time for you to get a lawyer you have to fight for your kids she came in like an angel a literal angel and let me tell you something in life you don't know who your friends are until the darkest times she adopted me at that point in my life she took me in gave me a key to her house opened up her family to me she said whenever it gets too too much when the entire nigeria the entire country was insulting me, calling me a whore. My ex-husband had come to tell everybody that I was sleeping around when I was pregnant, that I was having orgies. The entire country was on me like, yes, useless woman, idiot. This, that, that I had just given birth. I would have gone on, I would have run mad. Because when a woman just gives birth, it's postpartum depression, there are hormonal changes all over her body. All that pregnancy juices now coming out. She is literally, her body is changing. And that was the time that my ex chose to do what he did. A lame mom stepped in. She's like, we're not going to let you go on that. We're not going to let you run mad on the streets. We're not going to let you go. That is a lame mom. I got a lawyer. I managed to get my daughter back to give her breast milk. A lame mom was there. She said, close your eyes and pay the fees. $40,000. Pay it. She was there. I kept on paying. I kept on fighting for my kids. Fast forward to the day I was supposed to go to court with my ex-husband. I went to the court. I thought I was going to be alone. I was sitting down with my file, my lawyer. We were getting ready in the morning. Next thing you know, I turn to my left. I see four fully grown adults left their work, left their businesses, left their jobs, and came to help me in court. They sat down with me. They said, Chico Funana, yeah. it is our fight. LA mom, LA daddy, my dear pa, my auntie, they showed up in court 
when I was so distraught. I have never felt such love and support in my entire life. This is LA Mom. And since then until now, even throughout all the media crazies, she said, Cora, keep working, keep fighting. Keep fighting, keep working. Even when I was tired, she says, don't worry, you've got this. Elaine mom helped me with my house purchase. I went from being homeless to owning a $1.6 million house with LA mom in my ear every morning. She will wake me up at five. You've got this, you've got this. That's LA mom, a real life angel. A real life angel. So guys, please help me thank Ellie Mom. Hi, my people who is cutting onions for me. She really teared me up. Guys, Cora Obidi is the strongest woman ever. Believe it or not, this lady passed through a lot. She went through a lot. Ah, with all this her story and it still never finished on how she went through in the hands of that man. Ah, wow. No one is saying Cora Obide is, is, is an angel or oh, so innocent. Yes, I believe she also contributed one or two things, but, you know, postpartum <laughs> is another thing, eh? You can buy somebody. Yes. Well, let's just say happy birthday to Elemon. She's an exceptional woman for standing in for Cora Obide. You know, he's a... May God continue to bless her, my people. I don't want this video to be so long. If not, share what your opinion on this topic, on this thing, whole matter in the comment section below, guys. Oh, I'm short of words, guys. Thanks for watching, everyone. All in the name of marriage. Oh, God.